Hello, I'm Kevin Hayes, the Story Man. Welcome to the Nightly Bedtime Story Podcast, where you can hear a bedtime story every night. Tonight's bedtime story is Three Smart Little Foxes. I hope you like it. Three Smart Little Foxes There were once three little foxes who lived in a hole in a bank, and it was a large, comfortable hole, and these three little foxes, two of them were brothers and one was a sister, could lie down and put their heads out of the hole and see what was going on in the neighborhood. One afternoon, one of the brother foxes slipped out by himself for a little walk, and when he came back, he called the other two and said, Oh, come here, I will show you something and tell you all about it. So they all lay down close together and looked out of the hole. Now then, said the brother fox who had been out, you see that fence down there? Oh, yes, said his brother and sister. Well, on the other side of that fence is a splendid chicken yard. I went down there and saw it myself. I peeped through the fence, and in that yard there is a row of chicken coops, all with chickens in them. Oh, said the others. They began to feel hungry already. Yes, all with chickens in them, and I heard a little girl say that the row of coops was called Pullet Row. Chicken Avenue, and that all the houses were taken. The first coop had an old hen and eleven puffy little chickens in it, and the second one held a whole lot of small chickens, who were big enough to take care of themselves, and the next coop had in it an old rooster who had hurt his foot, and who had to be shut up. I think it is funny that neither mother nor father ever found out this splendid chicken yard, so near us, too. As soon as it gets to be a little dark, we must go down there and get some of those chickens. All right, said the sister fox. We'll go, and I'll take the first coop with the little chickens. And I'll take the coop with the young chickens, who are big enough to take care of themselves, said one of the brother foxes. I'll take the big old rooster, said the other brother fox. I like lots of chickens when I eat any. At the back of the hole, the old mother fox was lying down. Her children thought she was asleep, but she was not, and she heard all that they had been talking about. She now came forward and said, That is certainly a very nice place that you see down there, and you, my son, were very smart, no doubt, to discover it. But when you go down there this evening, take a look at a small house near the chicken yard. A dog lives there, a big black and white fellow named Bruce. He is led into the chicken yard every night at dark. If you think that he won't see you when you go inside, or that he can't run fast enough to catch you, it might be a very good idea for you to go down there this evening and get some chickens. The three little foxes looked at each other and concluded that they would not go. It was a long time after that before they were heard to boast of being smarter than their father and mother. The End Well, those little foxes thought they were smarter than their mother and father. They thought they'd found something that their mom and dad knew nothing about, and that they were much, much smarter than their mother and father, and they would go down there and get some chickens, and they would say, Ha! Look at us! We're smarter than you. Hmm. Turns out, maybe not. I hope you like tonight's bedtime story. The Three Little Foxes. I'm Kevin Hayes, the Story Man. I'll be back tomorrow night to read you another bedtime story. But for tonight, good night.